back out. Right, I'm going to do a wee bit of cooking tonight. So, I'm just going to a wee kind of local woodland part. I'm going to cook something different tonight. This is something I just saw online. Very, very simple. Uh, but what we'll do, I'll show you what I've got. we we'll got a wee fire going and then we'll, we'll cook this thing. Right, but I think it'll be quite good. It looked good. It looked simple. So, stay tuned. Right, what's cooking? So, I'll give you a wee clue, right? Packet of chilli heatwave Doritos. An egg. Just plain flour. Some baby bells. Now you're probably wondering what is he going to cook with baby bells for an egg and burritos? Well, you're about to find out. Obviously, a couple of plates just for making it with. Uh, got the zebra billy can. And I think it's the Yule or Grill I've, I've brought with me. I'm saying brought with me, actually leave it at this location. So I can just basically, so just basically make my fire pit. Just chuck the wood into it and I can cook the top of it. So we're going to set that up first. Uh, I'll get the fire on the go. And then what we'll do is we'll kind of pre prep. We'll prep what we're making. It doesn't even take a lot of prep either. So, let's go on with it. First things first, we're going to get the fire on. I've gathered up some wood. Just going to break that up a wee bit. And get the fire started. And I can chuck some bigger bits on after that. What I want to try and do is, I want to try and get the fire at a decent heat. Because basically what we're going to do, I'm going to be deep frying this. fire on just now, by the time I prep the rest of it, it should just be a case of chucking it on and then we'll see, see what it tastes like. Right, fire's going. So, like I say, we've got flour. Need a, an extra bag, is what we're going to do. And we've got the burritos. I see it's about a cup, maybe about a cup's worth of these. Get the burritos, put them in a bag. They're just supposed to get a, a rolling pin or something, but I have no rolling pin with me, so what you want to do is uh, cut these up into almost like a fine powder. So, let's do this is a very, very easy thing to make. Right, so that's the first part. Then we get an egg. One egg will do it. Crack that into I'm saying a bowl. I've just got my kapulka bowl with me tonight. Right, then you want to oh, 
ratio on the up, look at that. Right, and then you just want to whisk, whisk the egg up. Right, so I won't, so both of us seen this, probably online. Right, egg whisked. Once you've whisked the egg, you want to get the flour. Flour onto the plate, then you want to get the baby bells. You quite love cheese, don't you? Everybody loves cheese. Well, I know what I do. Right, you want to open all these up. Right, if I remember rightly, I think you just stick them into the flour first. Then the egg, and then we're going to dip them in the Dorito. Like a crushed up Dorito, should I say. While we're uh, digging up the Doritos, what I'm going to do, I'm going to put the billy can, zebra billy can, on the top of the fire, heat the oil up. So we'll do that just now. And then hopefully, by the time I've peeled all these, the oil will be heated up and we'll be good to go. Baby Bell's done, so first things first, just want to give them a wee kind of coat and flour. Right. So, easy enough. And then all I'm going to do, I could have done one on a plate here. What I'm going to do, I'm just going to tip them out. And that's it for you. Right. Mix up egg. So just want to get the egg. Right, then you want to actually coat the baby bell with the egg. Once you've coated the baby bell with the egg, you then put some into the, the Dorito mix. Right, and then basically just want to do that. All of them. So, like I said, it's a pretty simple, simple recipe. Simple, but it should taste pretty good. So, bring it back once I've done all six of them. Well, hope that's hot enough. So you do it. Oh yeah, that's hot. So I'm just going to chop them all in. Right as well, eh? Boom. Good bubbling away. I reckon to go on a sale on the tape, but two minutes, if you're lucky. I don't want to leave them on too long and then I try to pull them out enough <laughs> to basically melt it into a grey mess. So, right there, I'm going to just give it a double check. See that light? Oh. Right, I'll be honest. I think I've left them on a bit long. Right, definitely. Fuck oh, well. Tell you, I'm still gonna eat them. I'll definitely, I'll just. I probably actually. I don't know where the oil's been. Maybe too hot. Hey, yeah. oh. Maybe I just left them in a wee bit too long. So, I'm supposed to be kind of look kind of brown, but they look more kind of charred. Anyway, shut up, tastes fine. 
Right, I've also got a wee bit of uh, chilli sauce, sweet chilli sauce. Love sweet chilli sauce, you put it on anything, can't you? So we're going to give it the taste test. First attempt, so. Although the next time not to quite keep the water long enough. Mm, hard to do it. Looks good. Mm. Oh, stringy cheese, lovely. What does say oven bake them? Oh. Wow. But do they? so I just left them. Sorry, if I took them out a wee bit quicker. But I'm glad that, that does look good, does it? Anyway, I'm going to score for these and I'll bring you back in a minute. Well, first attempt. Definitely did put them on for too long so I kind of burnt them a wee bit but first attempt next time we'll know anyway time for a brew oh, that's hot so just a wee short video just trying something new so if you like to be video if you don't mind give it a wee thumbs up uh, leave a comment good or bad uh, and if you're not subscribed, like I say, hit the subscribe button, hit the bell for future notifications. If you're already subscribed, just double check that the, the bell's ticked for future notifications. Next camp uh, I'll be doing, it'll be at the weekend, so I think I'm meeting up with... Who am I meeting up with? Bugsy, Marco, Sean... Big Stu might be making an appearance. I think it's some folk are doing a two night, or I can only do the one night this weekend. I've got some on. Uh, but hopefully, maybe kind of the Saturday during the day, don't know what time Stuart will get there, maybe catch up with him as well. But that's it for this video. As ever, thanks very much for watching. And as ever, catch you in the next one. Adios. <laughs>